What's going on guys? Sorry, I'm Tandy Bubba Bam! Fellas, welcome back to episode number one of a new fan draft franchise. Kill the like button if you guys are excited. 10,000 likes for the next video. As soon as- oh, nah. I got to explain to you. You're wondering why there's not season three of Sam Fran. I'm gonna give you guys my entire explanation. I have good reasons. I wanted to do it. I was 50-50. Um, essentially, where do I even start? T-Hammer, um, a fellow YouTuber, you guys remember him from last year, he wanted to join the league. Um, so he was gonna, he was like, he had showed interest. He went and bought an Xbox just to join the league. Paris Campbell from the Colts, who's actually become a good friend of mine, he bought an Xbox just to join the lead, league. The, about 80% of the league wanted to reboot. And then I decided, I was like, okay, I am going to make an Instagram poll, um, which is you guys and what, I, I had enough reasons to like, enough people who wanted me to redo it and reboot because of the, like these YouTubers. They wanted like, it would be better with a fresh team. So I left it to a poll and in that poll, it was like 58% of people wanted a reboot. I'm gonna miss that team. I'm using the Eagles jerseys. As you guys can see, I'll kind of show you. I'm in Paris Campbell's division. Um, he's the Washington football team. Lil Wayne, uh, who's a really, really guy who's really, really good at running. He's in my division as well. Uh, and then this Verified Juice, I'm pretty sure he's a pretty good game as well. I got a tough division here. Um, T Hammer is the Broncos. Um, the commissioners made some decisions, which I, I agreed with, and I, I was part of them, um, to make a few more quarterbacks. There was a big update. Um, Joe Burrow is a superstar. Um, and then Derek Carr and Matthew Stafford, we also made a superstar. So those guys got superstars. So there's a few more superstar quarterbacks um, than there normally would be. Mac Jones is a star. Um, a couple other things that we did, Jalen Fields is still hidden. Uh, Trey Lance, obviously, yada, yada, yada. Um, the other thing I did, just again, I, I won't be drafting him. I just did this because I know how fresh he was. And I think he deserves star dev. I made, um, I don't even have to do it. What's his name? Oh, Jalen Hurts. I made Jalen Hurts a star dev as well because I'm just, oh no, they haven't. Someone's got, okay, I gotta let the commission know to make Jalen Hurts a star dev. But ladies and gentlemen, it's about to go down. Draft is about to start in a few minutes. I'll see you guys then. I'm pick five! So, someone just texted me on pick five. My app crashed. I'm pick five. I'm pick five. Oh my gosh. Holy snacks. Oh my gosh. I'm pick five. Let's go. I finally. Okay. I'm going to have my pick of the litter. Joe Burrow's an X. Kyler Murrow's an X. Herbert's a superstar. Oh my gosh, I might, I might be taking Joey Burrow. Do I go with Joe Fresh? If, if Kyler Murray's gone, I go with Joe Fresh. If Kyler Murray's there, I freaking win. Just give me the Super Bowl. Oh my gosh, okay. I can either go Justin Herbert, who I've had, or there's, there's X factors. Aaron Rodgers, Dak Prescott, they made Joe Burrow an X factor. Russell Wilson is only an 88 overall. They just lowered his a bunch. Justin Herbert is super interesting. 96 speed, 84. I feel like Justin Herbert is the pick here. But they made Joe an X Factor. Do I go with Swag and Joe Burrow? I don't care. Hate me later. Call the cops. Tell them shut up. Burr. I don't know if I should do it. I feel like I shouldn't do it. Oh my gosh. I don't think I should take him. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um... I can't go Wilson, man. They lowered him too much. I've already went Rodgers. I feel like Joe Burrow is the pick here, man. Burr, it's cold in here. There must be some Toros in the atmosphere. The Bam, fellas! Oh, let's go, man. Oh, maybe they made him an X Factor. Washington is they made him an X Factor. Holy snacks. These guys are a dime a dozen. There goes Vita Vea. But I do feel like there's one player here that I just don't think should be here and won't be here for very long. And it's a guy by the name of Christian McCaffrey. Let's go, man. He fell. I think he fell. I honestly, I feel like he fell. 92 speed, 93 acceleration, 97 agility, 93 juke. The guy is an absolute freaking menace in this game. And if Mike Williams is there for my next pick, I am going to cry. Uh, Calvin Ridley is no longer a superstar, but ladies and gentlemen, I think I gotta trust my, unless Waller is still kicking around. No, if Waller was there, I would take Waller at that spot. 
Ladies and gentlemen. Ba-bam! Mike the Man Williams. Bucket and bucket. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I'm absolutely sick right now. Um, there's, there's a glitch going on in Fantasy Draft where sometimes it will just glitch and nobody can pick their players. And you see how it just ran from round four, pick eight. We're now back at round four, pick four. We're now at round four, pick nine. It will just continue to glitch back and forth, meaning that this draft is all gone. So at this point, everyone who's in the league is going to join a new league and we are going to redraft, which is incredibly... Oh my gosh. They were trying to figure out right now if they're gonna give people back their picks, but yeah, essentially we're, um, we're redrafted. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, this is the redraft. I'm optimistic. I'm optimistic. We refill the league. Hopefully this does not happen. Pick six, let's go! Yo, the luck of the Irish, baby! The luck of the Irish! He's gone. Kyle Murray's gone. Okay, I, with my exact same pick, I get the exact same player. Ba-bam! I'm actually, I'm one pick different. Okay, so my second and third picks could be different, but honestly, I would have taken Joe Burrow at this spot either way. Okay. I got pick five. My luck has changed. I might, I might go Nick Chubb. I've never had Nick Chubb in a CFM. I feel like Nick Chubb may be the pick. Oh gosh, he's just a little stronger. He wasn't there last time. Oh my god, 98 break tackle, 92 speed. Nick Chubb. Ah, oh, let's do it, bam, bam, fellas. I went Nick Chubb instead. The reason, I'm gonna tell you guys the reason right now. He's only an 88 elusive back. So the reason I go Nick Chubb instead is because that trucking, he's more of a downhill runner and also just because of the fact that I can upgrade his, all you guys don't look at this. I can still upgrade him 12 elusive times. So this is a big thing to look for in these leagues. I, I don't think I cannot take Cooper Cup. Like I just, he's 96 overall. He's like the best route runner in the game. And he's an X factor. Like I, I do feel like it would be very difficult for me. There goes D Hop to not take him. Just as far as who's available at this point, receivers. Well, I want Mike Williams, but I feel like I can get him. Ninety six overall receiver, absolute freaking super stud. He may be eighty nine speed, but the guy is a monster. Right. Bam, fellas. Cooper Cup is going to Philadelphia. I'm gonna go Sneed. I'm gonna go Sneed. Okay, Sneed is gonna be my next pick. The reason I like Sneed, sorry, my camera, oh shoot, my camera just died. Yeah, pretty good man corner. He's got good enough size, like he's six feet tall. And um, with some, with like one slot upgrade, he's a 95 speed. Like I think he's a really, really, really good corner at that spot. My next pick, most likely I'll go corner as well. Um, the reason being for that is it's just, uh, it's, it's hard to say. I'm up. I think I'm gonna go Curtis Samuel. I had so much success with him a couple of years ago in a franchise. He was one of my favorite receivers. I think he's so good. 95 speed. I love him. Ba-bam, fellas! Curtis Samuel, baby. Like literally, remember the Lions franchise? I don't know if you remember the Lions franchise. Curtis Samuel was a monster for us. An absolute freaking monster. If I'm gonna spend that on somebody, it's gotta at least be a decent player who's somewhat young. Ronald Darby, DJ Reed, Trey Waynes. Oh gosh, okay. Christian Fulton, what do they have him at? Oh, Brett, I'm struggling. I think I get, I think I get Justin Simmons. He's the best player here. I, I think I get Justin Simmons and I put him in a bunch of zones. Um, boom, bam! He might not be my user, but even if I play him in zones, he's a really like, he's just a good player. I, I think I'm gonna get Asante Samuel Jr. This is good. I honestly, I'm kind of surprised that he's still there. Um, he's a man-to-man -man corner, rookie, 92 okay. speed, 93 acceleration. Um, and I'm very, very, very happy to have him on the team. I feel like that's a good second corner for us. Um, yeah, I, I, I think he can be a beast. 92 speed, 93 excel, and very, very, very young. He's a rookie, so he's gonna develop really quick. Very happy with that. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, my next pick, I rarely do this, but I felt like he was so good for me in my last one. Sorry, Heidi's here. Um, his 66 finesse move is pretty bad. But he's just, he's just a good athlete to have. I'm gonna take Adafe away. I, I feel like it's a good pick. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, Chase Claybrooks just showed up. I don't know if you guys know how it works. Um, but if I know um, 
the person picking in front of me, I know he'll take Claybrooks. But he's actually like, he's a good like kind of replacement. He's only 5'9". Bradbury's gone. I'm up at the Bradbury was still there. I can't believe Bradbury was still there. Claybrooks just showed up though. He's a 94 speed. That's really, really, really fast. He's going to play a lot for me at like either safety or as a blitzer in the nickel. So I'm going to take him. I feel like it's a decent pick. Uh, okay. I, I need a safety. I would say my needs are because we're only doing two more rounds. I need a safety and a corner. George Odom, he's 71. He's good. Don't get me wrong. But I just, I feel like, honestly, it, it's only right that I bring him. I'm, I'm hashtag T Higgins fan club. It's only right that I reunite him, man. It's only right that I reunite Joe and T Higgins. But this time he stays. Okay. With my last pick, I am taking from the Indianapolis Colts, Julian Blackman as my user. That's my final pick because we're only doing 11 rounds. So I'm going to see you guys in probably either. I don't know if I'm, this draft took ages. I don't know if we're playing anyone tonight, but I'm going to see you guys real soon. Ba bam fellas! Holy snack pack! It is the next morning, and it's showtime, ladies and gentlemen. Week one, guess we're going up against? It's Kia Kells, Keyshawn Kelly, the guy who's beaten me in three straight Super Bowls on the Steelers franchise. We're playing him week number one. I uh, I gotta update you guys on free agents. I was able to grab CJ Goodwin and just update you guys on who I got on my team. But first, we have an upgrade. I made sure that I had uh, Joe Burrow as my backup quarterback for the preseason, so we got a ton of reps. He gets an upgrade, which is freaking amazing because he was literally one upgrade away from Gunslinger. Boom, boom, bam! Burrow, my voice just cracked. I don't even care about it. Don't even care, long hair, don't care. Boom, Gunslinger, that's honestly, what an amazing, amazing quarterback he is. I also have an upgrade with Julian Blackman. He's someone, I'm just gonna keep upgrading the hybrid version of him um, because I definitely need speed upgrades with him. Jaron Williams, um, Jaron Williams, Brandon Wilson gets an upgrade. Um, let me see, hybrid, 63 overall, Brandon Wilson, that's going to get him to plus one, uh, two man coverage. Sean Lawrence, Gary on Conley, Tyler Huntley, yeah, none of these players are really like super, super crucial. I think I still have a training, but I still, I got to go through everything with you guys here, show you guys the team, show who the computer drafted. So why don't we take a gander at the team? So obviously Joe Burrow is our starting quarterback. Nobody has to question that. Joe Burrow is the guy. Starting running back is Nick Chubb. They drafted Rashad Penny as my second. Honestly, a pretty good second back. Um, third, let's see, third receiver. Okay, so this is where, these are my three receivers. Curtis Samuel, I want to switch to number 10 because in my other franchise, he was always number 10. They drafted Austin Hooper. Charles Leno Jr. was my, um, I honestly was pretty happy with my offensive line, what they did with my own line. It's not amazing, but it's like relatively young. Gabe Jackson, and then they got Mike Anuwu. Um, on, on a, I don't know. Danico Autry, who played for the Titan, plays for the Titans, had an amazing year this year. He's my left end. Right end is Leonard Williams. Defensive tackle, Linval. A um, little bit older, but a really high overall player. Odafe Owe plays there. Middle linebacker, you won't see. Cornerbacks, Sneed, Samuels, Brooks. And Goodwin. Like, we definitely don't have a ton of high overall corners, but we're going to be okay. Justin Simmons is going to just kind of play that true safety for me, I think. I'm, I'm in between having... It's tough to say. I kind of want to have him playing, like, a little closer. Currently, he's my user. Um, what's his change of direction? I don't know what his change of direction is. It's the only thing, and it used to be, like, just super on there. I'll have to look up what his change of direction is. Because that's a very, very, very important stat. But I, I'm between him and Julian Blackman is kind of my user. I have this Derek Forrest who will kind of play in the box as well. Clay Brooks and this guy are going to be kind of my sub linebackers. I think Julian Blackman for now will kind of play that position. And then Brandon Wilson is 92 speed. I feel like I need to have him in there. And then maybe the Forrest um, will play where Justin Simmons is. So that way, um, yeah. So that, that way he's in the game all, all, the, all the time. Kick returner is going to be Chase Claybrooks. Uh, punt returner, Isaiah McKenzie. Rush right end, not Zach Allen. Oh, Zach Allen's actually, that's a pretty good pick. I was going to go, I was going to go Adafe Owe though. That was kind of what I was thinking for my, my like, uh, when we're when we're past rushing, I feel like, oh, he's, he's the rush right end and the rush right left end. Okay, I got to switch that. Um, Leon Jacobs, Willie Gay, Barnes. I feel like maybe Willie Gay, just, just for the speed. 
The CPU actually drafted me a pretty good team, which I'm happy with. Uh, I've swagged out some of my players abilities wise. I have um, Cooper Cup with Deep Out Elite. Um, Nick Chubb, I gave Evasive and Tank. Uh, so we can like get rid of, he swagged out too. I swagged him out real cool. Um, the only other person I'm probably going to be changing here, I'm going to make sure, I'm going to put change Curtis Samuel's number real quick. I'm going to do that right now. Okay, so number 10, I forgot I was totally taken by Cooper Cup. The other cool thing that the computer did is they drafted me a superstar punter. Uh, so this punter is actually going to be kicking for us because I was able to give him folks as kickers. So I shouldn't miss any field goals, which is good. And he has 94 kick power. So I think that's a big, big W. Open day. Keys to victory. Let's go talk to the media real quick. It's opening to the weekend. Fresh start. What's the key to victory? Dominating offense. I feel like that's the difference between this year and last year. I, I really feel like we can pass the ball and run the ball. We got Nick Chubb. We got Cooper Cup. We got Joe Burrow. We are very, very good offensively. We should be able to move the ball. Going up against Keyshawn, let's go kind of check out his roster. Just to get an idea of what he's got. He's got a good left tackle, superstar left tackle, Mark Andrews, Jeffrey Simmons, who I wanted, Zeke, Ezekiel Elliott, Tressway, Matt Ryan, Woods. Okay, his quarterback. Oh, I was going to say, yo, I thought we got lucky. I thought we got freaking lucky. Oh, I was like, it's, it's going to be Matt Ryan. Either way, no one's got crazy rosters at this point. So it's all about finding a way to lock up, be smart. And ladies and gentlemen, we're on the road, week number one. Let's freaking go. Oh my gosh. Oof. 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 That seemed like it should have been a book. That seemed like it should have been a book. Dang it. That's such a book. That's such a book. I think this is good defense. I think I got good defense right now. I think I do. I, I don't know, but I think I do. And they'll try and throw for it with Lawrence. Let's go, defense! Go, Nick Chubb! Go, Nick Chubb! Let's go! Let's go, Giovanni! Good throw. First throw for Joe Burrow is a laser. Good stuff. I'm in between. I know like at a lot of points, I want to have Giovanni Bernard be that kind of like main passing running back for us. Just because I feel like that's where he, what he should be doing. Um, but it's definitely like, it's not... I, I do need to have the threat of Nick Chubb because he's so unbelievable. Like I just feel like to not have him in the game at any point is is shortchanging myself a little bit. Play action. It's Burrow. Let's go. Curtis Samuel! Oh my gosh, remember him! From the Lions franchise. Do you guys remember yet? Keyshawn made a really good user play on that. I, I'll give him credit where it is due. Like, he made a really good user play on that. Good job, Austin. Uh, but that's just Curtis Samuel, and I feel like he's going to make plays like that for me all freaking season. It's a good play. Good play. Yo, he got it. He got it. Shoot. Hey, good defense, guys. Good defense. Good defense. Fourth and 17. Let's go, man. Cover zero, baby. Hit him with a little bit of cover zero. You love to see it. You love to see it. Okay. It's good. Yeah, that's easy. It's too easy. Good stuff. He was sitting kind of right in the middle. That ended up working out perfect. He's going to like a more of a run D now. Like that's why that play, I was like, I'm, I might have a chance to kind of throw the ball a little bit downfield. But he's struggling with Nick Chubb at the moment. I don't feel like he, he has great defense against Nick Chubb. Go for a run, Nick. Go for a run, Nick Chubb. Let's go. Yo. Crown him! Let's go, Nick Chubb! 
Oh my gosh, you can't tackle the dude. And now they will throw it with Burrow. T. Higgins, baby. T. Higgins, let's go. Hashtag T. Higgins slant. Hashtag T. Higgins slant. Good route. Yeah, he's gone. He's gone. He's gone. He's gone. He's gone. Good job, Nick. Okay. Uh, do I go for two here? No, I just just take take the PAT. Good run call. He came out in man coverage. We caught him. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna miss this again. Can I call a timeout? Oh my gosh. Okay, what am I doing? On third down, Lawrence flushed out right. Oh, bro, and then he gets a broken play. It's a throw again is Lawrence. Thank you. Let's go, Justin Simmons. Good pick. Good pick, Simmons. Good pick. I don't think you sit on the ball going into the half when you have a chance to put some more points on the board. Let's go. Nice catch. Nice catch, Curtis. Nice catch. Out of the gun, it's Burrow. Flush to his right. He's gonna fire one Laser! Laser! Let's go! What a throw, Joey! Shoot. And they worked as well. You know what's that up it is. You know what's that up it is. First and ten, it's Lawrence. Oh. And he's got the hook up to Moore. And offense. Second and ten now, it's Lawrence. He threw it away. He's staying in the game. Respect. He doesn't want to, he does not want to throw a pick in that situation. Um, I just cannot believe the extra points. Like, it should be 21 to 6 right now. And not that it's like the biggest deal at this point, but it could become a big deal. On third down, Burrow. Dumps this to his running back, Chuck. They'll try and throw forward with Burrow. Escaping the pressure right. Laser, let's go, Curtis Samuel. Nice catch, Curtis Samuel. Nice catch, my guy. Good job, Nick. Stop short of from the shotgun, it's Burrow. He'll buy some time right. Laser. This is caught. Nice throw, Joe. Nice throw, Joe. Good job, Nick. Okay, what's what is the situation here? Okay, I got my real kicker in here, so I can but I gotta start actually kicking like I mean it. Hit the kick, good stuff. Okay. Thanks, bro. Thank you. Ba bam Justin Simmons. I got him figured out a little bit. I think I might have him figured out just a little bit. From the shotgun, Joe Burrow. Bruh, 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 bruh. 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 Shoot. Shoot. I should have ran the ball. Realistically, I should have ran the ball. There we go. Don't play cover two. Let's go. Nice catch, Curtis Samuel. Nice catch. That's a good run. That's a good run. That's a good run from Nick Chubb. Okay. I'm winning this game. I don't care. I'm winning this game. He's killed the clock on me many times before. So I I, I 100% plan on winning this. Good job, Nick Chubb. Good job. Good job, Nick Chubb. Good job, Nick Chubb. Take this clock away from him, Nick. Good job. Good job, Penny. Let's go, man. Like I said, after I threw that pick, I decided to say, and honestly, you guys can agree, I decided to say to myself, I'm not going to lose this game because of garbage extra points and because of a pick that I couldn't throw. We played amazing defense. I'm not going 0-1 for that reason. If you can't stop the run, get out of the kitchen. If you can't stop the run, get out of the freaking kitchen. And right now, I just, I just pushed you out of the kitchen. Run with Good job, Nick Chubb. Good game. Bam, bam fellas! So GG's, guys. Let's go, man. We played 
so good defensively. Held him to 46%. Um, two interceptions, 43% passer rating. Curtis Samuel had 125. Cup had two for 88. We played really, really, really well. And I'm, I'm proud of myself. That's how you got You can't give that guy any confidence or bragging rights. I refuse to do that. Um, and I like him to know that I can beat him. And that truthfully should have been a much bigger, had I not thrown that pick, I just started thinking in my head, I'm like, if I lose this game because of these extra points and a pick, I am going to scream very, very, very loud. He's upset, whatever it is, what it is. We played awesome. Joe Burrow looked really, really good in my opinion. Um, like really, really, really good. Um, 281, he kind of went a little bit crazy. Nick Chubb went crazy too, he's a stud. Curtis Samuel was just open all the time. He's a good receiver. Like I said, I've had him in other CFMs. I think he's just such a beast. We got the 49ers next week, who I believe is the former Browns. So it should be, uh, yeah, it should be a good game. It should be a good game. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, up, fellas, week number two. Honestly, I, I could not be happier with week number one. I was most impressed, I would say, if, if we're talking like biggest shocks for me and like I knew that the guy was a beast Nick Chubb is like he broke so many tackles for me it should have been criminal he was unbelievable our defense Justin Simmons moves around really really nice I got two user lurks with Justin Simmons and his 88 speed uh which let him fall to like round six as a 92 speed player holy snack pack okay um okay Slot upgrade for Ladarius Need. Slot upgrade plus four man coverage. Are you kidding me? That's helpful. That's very, very helpful. Okay. Curtis Samuel. I'm gonna upgrade his deep threat. Um, just help with his deep threat or deep route running. I just find he's so good in this game. Plus two deep route running. Okay, nothing crazy in terms of upgrade. We're chilling right now. We're chilling. No, no, nothing too crazy. Gonna upgrade T. Higgins deep threat because ideally at some point I want to make him a superstar and get him deep out elite. Plus one on the sped catch for him. No speed upgrades. Oh my gosh, we got Cooper Cup too. Okay, Asante Samuel Jr. This one I got a good feeling about. I feel like this this could be potentially the speed upgrade. Plus three man coverage, plus three press. Sometimes I got great luck. Sometimes I don't. Okay, with Cooper Cup, I definitely want to be upgrading his deep threat. But I don't know what, like, you guys got to help me out in the comments for future Cooper Cup upgrades. What do you upgrade for speed in these? Like, I, I don't know. I, I find myself very, very confused to know, like, on what to do for receivers. I, I Receivers I find a little bit random. Is it physical? Because it is kind of a physical gift. What is it that you upgrade? We got our first game at home against the 0-1 San Francisco 49ers. If we were to go and look at the Niners, um, see who he's got, Dalvin Cook, Dak Prescott. Okay, that's a good quarterback. Dalvin, Dak, Dalvin Cook, AJ Brown. Looks a little like my team last year. A little bit of AJ Brown on that team. Eric Ebron looks like my Steelers team. Cornerbacks, ooh, Minka Fitzpatrick. Okay, he's got a pretty solid team. Um, I don't think I'm gonna change anything in my game plan. I felt like everything we did went really, really well. So we're just gonna go into week two, have some fun. Let's go. On third down, it's Prescott. Oh, I'm a little slow. Good hit though. That's Forrest. On second down now, it's Cook. And across the midfield. They'll run it. Here's Cook. Yo, no, 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 no. Okay, red zone defense step up. Dang, that's a good run. From the shotgun, it's Prescott. Dang, laser. Okay. Good start for him. Okay, we gotta be smart. We gotta be real smart. Let's go. Get out the gym, Nick. Get out the gym, Nick Chubb. Good run. I gotta change his X Factor to trust. That's on me. I feel like Cooper Cup could be open here. It depends on what those safeties do. Oh, he's wide open. Let's go. Let's go for a run, Nick Chubb. Thank you. Get out there. Go, Nick Chubb. Thank you. Yo, it, it wasn't necessarily meant to start like this, where Nick Chubb is literally every single play. But right now, he is. This guy's. He's having some trouble stopping him. So I'm not gonna stop running with him. Let's see if we can get some people moving here. Yeah, he moved. Curtis Samuel. Let's go. Good throw, Joe. Good throw, Joe Burrow. Thank you. Yep. Good job, Nick. Why that? Brett, come on. Be better than that. That's bad. That's not good. 
He's gonna think I'm running here. Oh, he's on his defensive line. Cooper Cup! Cooper Cup! Let's go! Step up, man! Man him up on him. I'll, and that way, I think he will... I think he will look to 18, and then I'm gonna cover everyone on the other side. That post right there. Julian Blackman! Let's go! Go, Julian! Go, Julian! Oh! Cooper Cup! Cooper Cup! Yo, the way he run, like, he just gets open, man. That's two touchdowns for him in this game. Yo, oh my gosh, McMath. Dang. That's Racy McMath from the Titans. He's like, I think he could be really, really good in real life. But man, like at some point, not right now, he's not. Shoot. He torched my DB right there. Okay, I can't give him time. That's a laser. Back to Racy McMath. Okay. 14 up. Okay, offense. We got to keep scoring. The right blocks. I'm looking for Cooper Cup here. Nope, we got him. Austin. Fooled him. I, he was, I think he was pretty certain that I, I was running there. Um, which is fair. I was in like a really random run set. Austin got open. Good throw. That's a good play. Curtis Samuel. Curtis Samuel. I see you, Samuel. That took a little while for him to get open. Took a little longer than I would have hoped for him to get open, but he did manage to get open nonetheless. Come on, Joe. What are we thinking, Joe? Oh, that safety on the one side just went down. Second and ten. I don't know if this is the right call. Uh, I'm not. I was gonna run, but I don't. Yeah. Curtis Samuel, just get upfield. Get upfield. Fight. 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 Let's go, Joe. Nope. Cooper Cup. Shoot. Shoot. I'm out. Let's go, Austin. Good stuff, Austin. Okay, that was stressful. Another try after the first down sack. I see you, T. Higgins. I see you, T. Higgins. Ooh, ah, one guy to beat. Roughing the passer, okay. On third down, Burrow. T. Higgins, baby! T. Higgins, baby! Let's go! Yo, that's hey! I, I had to keep him with Joe. I had he thrives. He thrives when he's playing with Joe Burrow. Good stuff, T. Higgins. You can't go out there and go three and out and run the risk of falling behind substantially. Come here. Infield fly, batters out at fair. Good job. Good defense. From the shotgun, it's Burrow. Taking a shot for Samuel. He's got a job, Curtis. Good stuff, Curtis Samuel. Here's Burrow setting up to throw it. Go up, go up, Cooper Cup. Oh, I love Cooper Cup. Not have done that. I should not have done that. Yeah, I think here's the situation. You're not thinking touchdowns anymore. Cooper Cup. Cooper Cup. To keep up with your theme there, playing keeper. You score here, that might put this one to bed. I like the fact that they're playing with confidence and not playing with fear. 
Holy snacks! Yo, this team is in. We're making. Yo, Curtis Samuel. I've told you guys. Curtis Samuel's my guy, bro. It's my freaking guy. Good stuff. Do I do I try and hit cup if it's one on one again? I don't think he'll leave one on one again. He did. That was that was even. I think that was cover two. You just can't disrespect cup. You cannot disrespect Cooper Cup. Oh my gosh. Ooh, that was pretty. Okay, let's, let's, let's kill the clock down here. Hashtag respect. Throw it away. Good game, dude. Ba bam fellas. Yo, we look good. We look real freaking good. Real, real, real good right now. Um, Cooper Cup had 94, Samuel 122, and T. Higgins 93. That's, that's all three of them around 100 yards in a game. That's freaking unbelievable. So clap it up. Ladies and gentlemen, fly, Eagles, fly. Uh, this is the new squad, new team, new colors at the Cowboys next week, and then the Chiefs. Um, but... I think we're gonna have a lot of fun with this team. I love, I just, there's so much. My game's gonna freeze because I went to try and upgrade after, but there's so many things to be excited about. Kill the like button, 10,000 likes for the next episode, and I'll see you all next time. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're doing a huge favor, and subscribe right now. Also, I have a second channel where I post NHL, MLB, NBA content. Link is down below. Go check that out. That would mean the world to me. Road to 200K on that channel. Thank you guys once again. My Instagram is at BrettBQB. My Twitter is TBarrettYT. And yeah, that's about it. Thank you guys for watching.